I use uh, acapella records a lot. I use acapella records because um, Eris uses acapella records a lot and scratch records. Um, I'm going to specifically show an acapella record I use a lot. Um, so it's this. We'll first hand it up. So Grant Nelson um, runs Nice and Ripe Records. Um, it's extremely amazing UK label. Most people know them. Um, so this, he did these Swing City um, acapellas, uh, which are just great. So they're long. I don't know if we can catch the light. It's just long bands of repeated vocals, essentially. I have acapella records that are like the acapella from a song to, to put over or something. These are just like repeated phrases. So let's see which one. Which one was I going to use? It's on the other side. Yeah, here we go. So, let's slow it down a little bit too. Oh, you give me vibe. 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 It's a really fun orchestration tool that you get to use and put over anything, and especially because they're repeated um, phrases. There's lots of um, scratch records and also some acapella records that are, quote, skipless. Um, like, ah, the DJ Swamp, the skip-proof scratch tool. Um, it's, it's, not, it's not actually skip it's close. Um, it gets a view about about there, um, but it's just repeated phrases on the on the whole thing. Um, so you can just kind of keep messing around with it a bunch. But anyway, so I love using acapellas to orchestrate over um, other tracks that are playing. So for example, this new birth anytime. And I also like. Why else do I like Pioneers? Because it has a really fun effects board on it, which is really fun to use with acapellas specifically. Um, Really fun. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> um, they're 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 just like they're. It's it's mostly like you'll see you'll find them as like DJ battle tools and stuff like that. Um, they're just they're just for constantly putting things you know just for for playing over everything. And I am not good at scratching. Scratching definitely sounds better when you have a ping pong delay on it and you're doing a very baby like back and forth because <laughs> it's just like. So it's a great way to cheat to sound like you're doing something cooler. I mean, you're doing something cool, but you know, like, I'm not, I'm not doing anything fancy right there. <laughs> 